Hello everyone, welcome back to Virginia's Cupcake. Today I will be showing you how to draw a Roblox avatar. So, let's get into it. Right now I'm drawing my old avatar. From like, I don't know. Well, it's old anyway. I've drawn many Roblox avatars for my friends. So, let's get into it. So first, we're going to want to do the basic parts of the body. So I'm going to go ahead and do that, and I'll explain to you how I did it afterwards. Okay, so one of the super hard parts is the legs, because you got to get it in, like, the perfect position where it's, like, there's no big gap and there's no too small of a gap. So that's what I'm working on right now. And at the end, I'm going to show you how I did it. Well, not really at the end, but when I'm done drawing. Okay, as you can see here, I pretty much have the base of the body. And to make it, like, less gray, you can just, like, erase some. See? Wow. Okay, so I got the base of the body. Next, we're going to move on to the head. Okay, so right now I'm drawing a girl with a ponytail because, well, just, yeah. So you can't really see the hair in the back like you can't see the ponytail. So you're going to have to just do it strand by strand to make it look like a ponytail. And I'll show you that. So first what I did is like you get part of it. And then you do like a strand, see that? You do like, that's a strand, right? And then you'll do like another strand where it's sort of covering this part of the face. Okay, so what I did at the top was, it's where you, it's like, so there's hair up here still, right? like that and then the ponytail sort of like goes into a curve right there and then you sort of get it to to go out of the head sort of like that and then I'm gonna do like a shorter one Right now, it sort of looks like a boy. Because, I mean, look at that. It sort of looks like a boy right now. Because we haven't really put all the hair on yet. And there's like this outer layer of hair right there. Okay. So there's like this line right here where the hair sort of like ends and then there's this point. Except I'm not gonna do it like that because I mean it sort of changed my mind. Because I mean it sort of looks weird like that so I'm gonna sort of try and change it a little bit just to make it make more sense. Okay, when I'm done with the hair, I'll be back. Okay, so as you can see, I sort of straightened up the body as well. So, we're going to get to the face later with all the details and stuff. But right now, we're going to do the clothing. So, this girl that I'm drawing, she's sort of wearing like a tank top sort of thing so I would advise flipping your paper like that okay and then she's just wearing pants all the way down 
And so I'm going to draw their little shoes. It's like... I'm going to put more detail into that later. Okay. So we're going to add the details and the, like, splotches on the clothing, well, sort of thing. A later... Okay, let's go back onto the face. Okay, so I have a unicorn sitting on top. So I'm gonna scoot that down closer and I'm gonna sketch out the body of the unicorn. Sort of has a little curve like that. Whoops. See, that's what normally, when people try and draw stuff like that, that's what normally happens. And that's what we're trying to avoid. So how to fix that problem is you just erase it. And you make it point into the middle. But then it looks like a person, not even a unicorn. So that's why we're gonna draw like little back legs. And then let's add the hair. Don't worry, we're gonna put more detail into that later. Okay, so we're gonna sort of flip it like this. And the horn. Okay. So that is what it looks like right now. I know you're probably just like, that looks so ugly. I mean, come on. What? That's what I'd be saying too. Because we're not done yet. So now we're just gonna add the ears. Like so. And then we're gonna add the ear. And I will come back when I'm done with the unicorn. Okay, so we sort of finished the sketch of the unicorn. We're gonna add some more stuff with color later, but and yes, I know you're probably just like, the feet look a little bit off. Well, we're gonna add more detail into that later. Okay. Now I'm just gonna flip this over. Draw a little line right there. Okay, back on to the face. Now we're gonna draw the eyes, which usually takes forever honestly, because like they need to be identical. Okay. Okay, something like that. We're gonna add more detail later. Actually, maybe those eyes need to be a little bit bigger. This is what I mean, see, it takes like forever. Okay. Yep, that's like way better, I have to say. Uh, should have sharpened this pencil. What? It's not erasing. It's broken. Okay. Well, I'm going to come back when I'm done with the eyes. 
Okay, there. We're going to add, like, the pupils and stuff later. I know, I keep saying later, but... Okay, time for the mask sort of thing. So... Sort of like this. And by the way, I still had this mask before COVID. So. This person looks like a psycho right now, I have to say. Okay, there is the mask. Okay. So we pretty much got the base of the face part down. Okay. Now, time for the coloring. Yes. Okay. Let's get started. So this the clothes that she's wearing is sort of purplish, I would say. I'm gonna open my art kit. Okay. I just discovered that I don't have a tan colored pencil. Um, one, ah. Okay, we'll figure that out later. Okay. So I'll start sort of a galaxy look. So I'm gonna... Okay, so those are sort of like blobs and then I'm gonna get the pink. And y'all can follow along with me and draw this exact avatar if y'all would like. I'm just gonna fill out those little spots. Okay. Like that. Whoops. Okay. So I'm going to get the purple again. And just pretty much do random spots. See that? Go randomly down here. Like that, pretty much. Okay, so some of the spots are white and some of them are pink. So what we're gonna do is just do both. Random spots, sort of fades. A what? Okay. Yeah. Like that, sort of. Okay. Sort of-ish, like that. Okay. Now, we're going to go on to the unicorn part. So the colors that I'm looking at is sort of a turquoise and a yellow. So I'm gonna go ahead and color that in. Okay. So, unicorn's done, pretty much. See, the legs are too skinny. That's what you always have to watch out for.
there. Okay. Gonna get my little pink mm. color those things in. Supposedly things. And I'm going to color the horn blue. Like that. Okay. Well, desperately looks for pencil sharpener. Okay, so we got that part down. And now we're gonna move on to the skin color and then the eyes. Okay, sharpened my pencils and I found a twistable that I'm gonna use for the skin color. So I'm gonna go ahead and color all the skin. Okay, there. Now I'm going to do the eyes. Okay. Oh, I just realized I forgot one part over here on the skin color. Okay. Now we got that part done. I'm going to finish the logo on these shoes and put more detail into the shoes. Okay, did that part, time for the hair. You can make the hair any color you would like, except on what I am copying is blonde. So I'm just gonna use this yellow. Oh, is that right? Yeah, it is. gonna add some more stuff onto here like that okay we got that part done now I'm gonna add more detail onto here okay I suggest flip your oh well, you can see the book I'm reading okay I suggest you flip your thing this way and you put the detail into the mask. Okay. Pretty much done with that. Okay. Dang it, I forgot to sharpen my pink. It's going to be hard. Oh, dang. Oh. Okay. And you color in the part in the ear. And you are pretty much done. Just going to add some more detail to here. And, yeah. And we are done with that. I hope y'all enjoyed. And... Comment down in the comments below if you want me to draw another Roblox avatar. Anyway, bye!